All right, welcome back here to the channel. Today is August 12th of 2024. We've got an item shop to check out. I'm curious if we have the new Star Wars stuff. Because they said the 12th, but it could maybe be tomorrow too. But... Okay, we're starting with X-Men, so maybe not. But if you would like to get the X-Men bundle, it is 3,800 V-Bucks and includes everything. If you would like just Cyclops, he is 2,000 and includes his emote. Colossus also includes his emote in his 2,000. Jubilee is 1,500 and her pickaxe is 800 separately. We also still have all of the Dragon Ball stuff. Goku and Beerus are 2,700 V-Bucks for their whole bundle. Vegeta and Bluma is 2,300 for their bundle. Dragon Ball Power Bundle is 1,500 V-Bucks. It includes a glider, two emotes, and a back bling. The Android 17 and 18 bundle is 2,300. Trunks is 2,000. Both of the Android skins individually are 1,500. Son Goku is 2,000. Beerus is 1,500. Vegeta is 1,800. Bluma is 1,200. We can get the Dragon Ball gear bundle for a thousand. All of the emotes are 400 each. We also have the Back Bling and Pickaxe bundle for 600. The Space Pod Glider for 800. Dragon Radar Back Bling for 300. And Shenron Glider for 1200. You can get the Goku Black Bundle for 1800 V-Bucks, just the skin for 1500 and each of the pickaxes are 800 We also have the Piccolo Bundle available for 2200 Son Gohan's Bundle for 2200 just the skin for 1800 just Piccolo for 1800 The pickaxe is 800 the glider is 800 Piccolo's pickaxe is 800 and his glider is 800 We also have Cell and Frieza available for 1500 each, or the bundle for 2300 Their pickaxe is 800 Frieza's is 800 and the glider is 1200 or you can get the whole bundle for 1600 We also still have the Nikki Goddess skin available for 1200 Her back bling glider bundle is 1200 The Flame of Victory pickaxe is 800 and you can get the Victory Leap emote for 300 we also have her whole bundle for 2,500. You can get the Euphoria pack for 1,800. The gear bundle for 1,300, and each of the pickaxes are 800 each. The glider is 800, and the emote is 200. You can get the back and hack pickaxe for 800. The fresh out of the box emote is 500. You can get Eclipse for 1,500. Euphoria for 1,500, and their whole bundle for 2,500. We also still have the Eilish available for 1500 her guitar is 800 her drums is 800 and her back bling is 400 Her whole bundle is 2300 Okay, we do have some Star Wars. You can get both of her emotes. They are each 500 individually. You can get her jam tracks for 500 each or the whole bundle for 1500 so for Star Wars, we do have Boba Fett available again. He is 1500 and does include his emote. And he was last seen 87 days ago. You can get his glider for 1200, his pickaxe for 800, and the whole bundle for 2300. We also have Fennec Shand available again for 1500 and Crescent him. I don't know how to say his name, but he's also 1500 and they were both last seen 339 days ago. Fennec's glider is 800. You can get the This is the Way emote for 200. This is the way. And their whole bundle for 2300. We also have the Endo drum kit available again for 1000. The Keytar for 800. The Cantina band jam track for 500. And the whole bundle for 1200 V-Bucks. We also have the Beskar bundle available for 2800. The Darth Maul wheel bundle for 400. And the red lightsaber boost trail for 400. I'm pretty sure the new Star Wars stuff is supposed to also be here. <laughs> but it's not, so maybe it'll come later? I don't know. We still have all of the reload skins available. They're all 800 V-Bucks. You can get the masculine bundle for 2,000. The feminine bundle is also 2,000. And they're all pretty cute. You can still get the Cybertruck for 2,800, the Beast Mode Boost for 400, the Serious Boost for 400, and the Orbit Wheels for 400. The Alan Walker Jaeger Bundle is still available for 1,500 V-Buck. You can get the Darker Side Wheel Bundle for 400, Diamond Hearted Wheels for 400, and the Front Row Boost for 400. We also have the Incendio Bundle available for 1,500. 
Down here in signature style, we have Vector available again for 1200 V-Bucks. He was last seen 406 days ago. You can get his Wild Changent Pickaxe for 500, the Ion Glider for 800, and the Hexform Wrap for 500, which is animated. We also have the Slow Clap emo available again for 200 V-Bucks. Guaco is back. He was last seen 405 days ago, and he is 1200. Volley Girl was last seen 349 days ago, and it's 1200. We also have Adeline available again for 1200, who was last seen 368 days ago. Riley for 1200, Toxic Tiger for 1200, and Heist for 1200, who were all last seen 346 days ago. You can also get the Full Tilt Traversal emote for 500 and the Wild X Wrap for 300. Lace is still available for 1500 and Paradox is also 1500. You can get the Vision Pickaxe for 800, the Equilibrium Glider for 500 and their bundle for 2,000. Scout is still available for 800. The Ordered Cutlass is 800. Asteroid Trencher Pickaxe is 800. The Meteor Skinner Glider is 1,200, and the Cypress Needle is 1,200. You can also get Ether for 1,500. The Leap and Traversal Emote for 500. Tech Turbine for 800. The Web Wrecker Pickaxe for 800. The Scully Splitter Pickaxe for 800. Scully for 1,200. X for 800 and the Outlaw emote for 500. You can still get Vegeta 777's Locker Bundle for 2,500 V-Bucks. Individually, you can get Bash for 1,500, the Breezy Bashers Pickaxes for 1,200, the Bright Blimp Glider for 1,200, and the Star Power emote for 800. The Wastelander Level Up Quest Pack is still available. It is 1,200 V-Bucks. Yes. <laughs> And you can unlock 28 levels towards your battle pass. We have the Checkmate Drums available again. Those look real. That photo is bad. But we have new drums. These are kind of cute. Metro Gnome for 800. I kind of love them. Not going to lie. This is also new. The Restorer Keys Keytar. Pretty cool. It is also 800 V Bucks. You can still get the Bucket Brigade drums for 800, the Loud Pipes microphone for 800, PCB six string for 800, and the Motherboard bass for 800. Here's a look at today's highlighted jam tracks. They are all 500 each. Metallica is still available. We have the Seaport style bundle available for LEGO Fortnite for 200, Captain's Cabin for 300, and Captain's Battlement Kit for 800. You get the whole bundle for 1,000. You can join Fortnite Crew for 11.99 a month. Get 25 levels towards your battle pass for 18.50. Get the Festival Pass for 1,800. The Lockjaw Starter Quest Pack for 9.99. The Magma Masters Pack for 17.25, which includes three skins and three back blings. The Marvel Royalty and Warriors pack for $28.99, which includes three skins, three backlinks, three pickaxes, a contrail, and a glider. Summer Legends for $18.49, which includes three skins, three backlinks. Something just refreshed. Okay. Natural Constructor for $18.49, which includes the skin, a backlink, pickaxe, and access to play Save the World. Crimson Warden for $4.49, which includes the skin, backlink, pickaxes, and $600 V-Bucks. Lastly, we have Operation Bright Starter for $375 which includes the skin, back bling, and LEGO Fortnite items. And I am... No, they are up here. Wait, did we go over these two? I don't think so. Well, in case we didn't, you can get the Guardians of the Galaxy pack for $28.99, which includes three skins, three back blings, three pickaxes, and two emotes. And the Gilded Elites pack for $17.25, which includes three skins, three back blings, and three pickaxes. Let's see if... Star Wars refreshed because I'm like so certain that the new stuff is supposed to be here. There it is. <laughs> All right, so we do have our new skins. This is IG11, and here is his like robot skin. I it looks good. I yeah, I don't have anything like negative to say. I think it looks really good. We have the Grogu back bling with IG11. I don't love it. I think it looks fine. And then the pickaxe, which again, it's kind of fine. As far as like Star Wars pickaxes go, it's pretty decent. We get that whole bundle for 2,100. We also have the Moff Gideon bundle available for 2,500. And you get half his helmet off or helmet on. His back bling, which is just like the jetpack, I guess. It's kind of whatever, honestly. His force lance. 
I like that. That's pretty good. And the Force Lance Flourish, which is a built-in emote. Hmm. I wanted that to do more. <laughs> then we have his wrap, which is pretty basic, but I do like it. If you would just like Moth Gideon, it is 1500. You can get the Forest Lance pickaxe and emote for 1200 V Bucks. The wrap is 500 and it's reactive? Let's see. Oh, interesting. That's fine. It's still kind of whatever, honestly. IG-11 is 1,500. You can get his pickaxe for 800 and Grogu for 600 individually, which I'm sure many people will buy. He is cute. And yeah, that's all the Star Wars stuff. Cool. I'm glad it refreshed before I finished this video. <laughs> before you go, we'll take a look at everything in their LEGO versions. Here is Boba Fett, Fennec, the Wookiee. He looks like something out of... Oh my gosh, it is on the tip of my tongue. Like, like kind of like the Alice in Wonderland um, lion plant, but also, I can't think of it. I'm gonna like have to leave you guys on a cliffhanger. I can't think of it. <laughs> this is the way emote. We have Moff Gideon. Does not look like the emote will work, which makes sense because it is tied to the pickaxe. We have IG-11. He looks kind of silly, but that's fine. Jonesy the First, Hawk Classic, Original Renegade, Rookie Spitfire, Headhunter Prime, Finch's Ramirez, Vanguard Banshee, and Wild Streak. We have Nike Goddess, the Victory Leap emote. You can do the Keep Em Crispy emote. As well as the Fresh Out of the Box emote. We also have Eclipse and Aerophorian. Here is Cyclops, Colossus, and Jubilee. Red Roots Billy, and both of her emotes work in Lego as well. Vector, Guaco, who looks perfect. I love him. Slow Clap. Volley Girl. Heist. Toxic Tagger. You could do the Full Tilt emote. Riley, Adeline, Lace, and Paradox. Here is Scout and Cypress Neal, Ether, X, and Scully, Wasteland Dummy. Here is Bash, and you can do the Star Power emote. This one's Fortnite Crew skin. We have Drax, Lux. Cinder, Kuno, T'Challa, Fable, The Natural Constructor, Crimson Warden, and Bright Bomber. Okay, and that is everything in today's item shop in totality. We got 10 skins rotated in, as well as a couple new skins. Let me know what you guys think of these new skins. I think they look good. I just think it's a really weird time to be bringing in new Star Wars content. It's the end of the season. I feel like we should be wrapping things up, not really necessarily introducing new stuff, especially when Marvel's gonna be the focus of the next season and all of this stuff is still going to be in the shop when the new season starts, so I don't know, that's just kind of weird, but maybe that's just me. If you are going to pick up these skins though, definitely be sure to use my creator code, Robotosaurus, it helps me out a ton, and I will see you guys tomorrow for another item shop upload. Until then though, I hope you have a really great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys then. Bye.